Mogus, Mogus, let's not blow this. Mogus, Mogus, let's go now. Hey there, Plastic Cactus here with your old buddy Kravuius. Kravius, okay, he's not your old buddy. He's the first time you ever saw him. Surprise, surprise, we're facing a Loro, king of the poopy pants. Oh, Loro. This is a keep. And cousin the Mana Crypt and the Worn Power Stone. Ugh, I'm gonna do it. Ugh, I'm not happy about it. <sighs> yep, gain your life. Um. So incidentally, since last we saw each other, how oh, you been, by the way? It's been a spell. Uh, I've added some things and subtracted some things to this deck because it sorely, sorely needed it. Uh, let's do some more Power Stone here. Boom. Okay, so we have five mana next turn. So, yeah, it, it lacked a, a decent defense, and it needed more mana ramp because this deck thrives on mana ramp and totally, totally crumbles when it doesn't have said mana ramp. So I added some of that, the Colony Gem, the Basalt Monolith, Crawl Space, Wrecking Ball, and I also added Life's Finale. Because why not? Everyone can use life's finale, right? Sure. Um, let's get to red. I mean, uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, life's finale. Back to the task at hand. Life's finale. It's a board wipe. So I I had like six board wipes now. Should be enough to screw over my opponent while I'm getting the necessary mana to blow up his dirty face. Uh, as you can see, things are moving up a little bit. So hopefully, uh, all these additions are going to work out. I had to get rid of Extra Planar Lens, uh, which I am not missing. Both times I drew it, it was a complete whiff, did absolutely nothing in the past. I think it's just for monocolored decks, let's be honest. I, I was looking for mana ramp and I was like, yeah, I haven't used this one. I uh, sure it could work in a dual color. Duh. Um no, it, it doesn't really. Of course now that I said that I'm drawing all these fucking mountains and it would totally work. But no. No no no. We're doing Mogus. Mogus is out. Uh, I got rid of so I got rid of extra problem lens. I also got rid of Seder Fire Dancer, uh, Blightning, and Passing and Flames because they're all circumstantial. And uh, if the circumstances don't go well, and they haven't been, though, then those circumstances won't uh, appear, and I won't be able to use it. Mogus and Aloro kind of cross each other out right now, but once I start drawing the things that make it so he can't draw life, and Mogus kicks the other hand. Magmatic Force should be good. I think that's next turn. Sure is. Sure is. Yeah, we'll do that. So what's up next? Oh, and I also I also had to get rid of Chandra, which is too bad. That's a sad one to go. I like that fiery lady, but of all the ugh, of all. The Planeswalker, she was the most expendable for sure. Uh, Necropotence, jeez. Hmm. This is either going to really help or really hurt. Probably really hurt. I think maybe I ought to just Oblivion Stone, huh? Eh, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe we can do it without Oblivion Stone right now. Hmm. Yeah, we're going to go for the mag magmatic force first. See if we can't make that work. I surely hope so. Bait out a few more things, maybe. Or gain me seven life. Okay. Well, it was going to happen sooner or later. Mm. Okay. 
Okay. Yeah, maybe I guess it's just Oblivion Stone time. I'll put a I'll put a stone a thing on the Warm Power Stone before I blow up for sure. Blood Baron of Viscopa. Mm-hmm. Yup, yup. Get your cards. Get your cards. Necropotence. Ugh. Gross. Yes. Oh, I lost the flip. I'm surprised. All right. This is important. We'll do this. And we'll also do uh, Oblivion Stone. And it'll just kind of sit there for a while. Because I definitely want to put at least something on this and something on the Warm Power Stone. If Mana Crypt dies, I think I'll be fine. But yeah, that's that's the plan anyway. No life gain for you, buddy. Sorry. That shuts your deck down. Well, now that I actually, since I have Lice Finale and Earthquake and Bogard and Hellkite, all good things to blow shit up with, I could probably afford to put a, a fake counter on, you know, all three of the things I want to keep. And then, you know, blow up Shrine. Hey, that's totally fine. Play No Mercy. I've got no real creatures that are going to do much of anything anyway. So, way to go. Awesome. All right, back down to 40 life where I belong. I, I don't trust it when I'm a higher life. No siree. Uh, yes. I won the flip. Huzzah! Crawl space. Let's just fate counter. No, we'll Bell Garden Hellkite on the end of his turn. I think. Yeah, that's the ticket. Bell Garden Hellkite. Or when he attacks. That works too. Ain't got no protection from red. Uh oh, what you got here, fancy pants? What you got here? Hmm. I won't care to uh, fake counter the Hellkite either. Enigma Sphinx. Just put it in your grave for the battle. Put it into the library third from the top. Cascade. Way to go. I still kill the Blood Baron, I think. Do I, though? No. I kill the Enigma Sphinx, and then I eat the Blood Baron. Obviously. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, surprise, surprise, motherfucker. What's this? What is thisy, thisy, this? Pop. Pop. Pick. Nice. Cool, dude. Oh. Okay. Well, that works too, then. That's too bad. Ha! What an error! Uh, even his burn damage does him in. Well, I'll, pile, I'll file that under future reference knowledge, please. But that's okay. He was gonna die soon anyway, but at least I would have been able to eat Blood Baron before that. Hey, I lost the flip! Oh, lost the flip. Very, very nice. You know what I really need? Is a fucking swamp. No, that's not true. I've got the Urbarg, you dumbass. Um, yeah, okay. So here's paying for Quandary. And whatever, I'll put down Crawl Space too. I'm never blowing up this Oblivion Ring, it looks like. <laughs> mm. 
It's fine, it's fine. Go ahead and hit me for a four again. Shroud of the Burning Bullshits is gonna do some heavy damage this turn. I mean, this game, huh? Huh? Yeah, it totally is. Might be time to Earthquake next turn. Let's see what he plays. Might be time to Earthquake. Or maybe it's just life's finale. Oh, we got something big happening. Divinity of Pride gets plus four, plus four, as long as you have 25 or more life. Uh, I mean, I mean, it's not going to do much. I do need, well, that's just, it's going to kill it because this is going to do a bunch of damage to the player too. So it's fine. That's just going to die. I will Earthquake. I will Earthquake. Gonna just do some heavy earthquake. Oh, you keep drawing those cards. You're not gonna like what happens. Heads! Oh, curses. Foiled again. All right. It's earthquake time. Mm, yep. Looking good. Owie! What? How did that not die? Oh, because it flies. <laughs> That's okay. You can hit me for four. I'll hit you for 11. 11. No, tw okay, so 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. We're at 17! And then, you know, he's probably going to want to draw some cards, so that's some more damage done to him. Okay, that's not going to do anything whatsoever. Nothing. Congratulations. Absolutely nothing. You do not do things. Alrighty. Life's finale? I guess I ought to. I ought to life's finale. Um, and also Shrine of Burning Rage. Because enough's enough already. I lost the flip! Okay. Yeah. Enough's enough. We are life's finale and we're Shrine of Burning Raging this turn. What would save him? What would save him? Um, that wouldn't that wouldn't save him. That would be annoying. Fell deer, earth sworn, dog scale. Well, none of these are gonna save him because he can't draw life. So I guess it doesn't really matter. Glenn, I don't want him to counter me. Fuck that. Uh, I guess Obzadot would be pretty annoying. And let's get rid of. The guild mage for combo shenanigans. Oopsie! It costs three, not two. Oopsie, poopsie, poopsie. Oh, whatever. I hit him for 13 with that thing. That's pretty good. So I all I have to do next turn is blow this up and play Slagstorm, and I win. I think. I'm pretty sure that's the case, which is great. It's good to know that I can do some tinkering with this deck and it could be relatively successful. Granted, uh, this fucking thing was built for shit like Aloro. I mean, Aloro just crumbles to everlasting torment ability. And I've got two other cards in this deck just like it. No, uh, no tutors though. So, I had to get a little lucky, and I think I did. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. I think I'm fine with that. Yes. 
I think I still might be able to win just with Slagstorm and Shrine of the Burning Rage. Yeah, I think so. I lost the flip, but that's okay. Slagstorm is here to stay. Three damage to each player. And Shrine of Burning Rage. One, two, three, go. Yeah. All right. A victory. Mogus, you got one under your belt besides that cheap victory last week against the guy who couldn't draw any blue mana. So sweet. Let's do another one. Mogus, Mogus, let's not blow this.